mean, can you even believe the nerve of this little psycho? Sasquatches are spot. And this is not a selfie, which begs the question, who took it? And how recently was he inside her? Hey, Dars, you're spiraling. How about we just... Oh, shut up. Meanwhile, you go on one blind date and magically fall in love with some gorgeous pediatrician. Hey, you deserve a gorgeous pediatrician, too. And it wasn't magic, it was data. Hmm? So, before I came to Startup Land, I was coding for a defense contractor. What? Ew. Are you coming out as a conservative now? Do you own a gun? Hey, I needed the money, okay? The point is, we sorta accidentally built this AI with unlimited access to personal information. I mean, the whole thing got shut down, but now the team is pivoting the technology into commercial applications, like potential mate selection. So you're saying there's a secret app that can tell me who to date? Even better than I can. It's called Crystal, like a crystal ball that can see your future with someone. Here. Okay, so it runs in the background. You just pop in your earbud and you'll hear it. Hey, I'm Crystal. Just confirming, Darcy Birdman, born in Ann Arbor. You can talk back to her, Darcy. Oh, yes, hi, that's me, hello. What's up, Darcy? I just synthesized all of your digital behavior to better help you find your match. I'm standing by. So now just feed her a picture of someone and she'll tell you the likelihood of a long-term relationship with them. And it works. Data doesn't lie. Okay, all I need is a picture and I can determine your compatibility with anyone. Lonely guy in the corner? That's gonna be Harold Burke. And I'm pretty sure he's not your type. His clothes are from Costco and he secretly eats Lunchables for lunch. Okay, fair, but if I wasn't him, what are the odds of it working out? 0.03%. Whoa, I'm not that food snobby. He had a vasectomy last year. So that's not a deal breaker? It will be soon. You like pictures of your friend's kids more than travel photos or foodie pics, which are supposedly your top two interests. Okay, Snoop Dogg, maybe I just support their happy lives. That doesn't necessarily mean I want kids. It totally means that. Also, your Evite account shows your baby shower attendance rate has gone up 60% in the last two years. But I have so much free time. You think? Now let's get you back in the game. Who's next? Hey, how are you with exes? Better than you are. That's it? Girl, he just broke up with you 63 hours ago. And it's for the best. Oh my god. Did I have sex with a flat earther? Oh, much worse. <gasps> oh no. This is who you pick when left to your own devices. Ooh, let me guess who you're gonna look up next. Work crush, Brian Long? Um, no. Please, you check his Instagram two to three times a day and once spent 12 minutes composing this comment. And the chances of you guys ending up- Okay, shush, 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 shush. Don't just blurt out our compatibility. I mean, is he into me or could he be into me? He's likely to find you attractive. What? Ew, no, I meant like as humans. He does have a history of dating secret fans of The Bachelor. Does he watch The Bachelor? No, but women who watch The Bachelor yet conceal it are likely to say they're feminists, but behave as romantics. Brian appreciates a progressive outlook, but enjoys a girl getting giddy on a first date. And he's available? Like actually looking for a relationship? Mm, he says he is, but he also has interests which don't correlate with actually pursuing one. I, I mean, I could live the hashtag van life. A guy who wants to wake up in a different spot every day is not looking for commitment. Odds of you locking that down? What? No, we have chemistry. Sorry, hun, the data is clear. Brian backs off when his partners move too fast. Hey, I could be chill. I could be a super chill Dan ass bitch, baby. Actually, you see relationships as a series of goals. Well, excuse me for knowing what I want. And you do anything in your power to achieve those goals. That was a joke. Look, maybe it's time to do some soul searching. Rethink your whole approach to this dating thing. OK, 
Okay, so I know that I've been a little extra at times, but... What if you helped? I'm trying to. No, not just help me pick, but... Suppose I wanted to give Brian my final rose. What if I date him? With your help? That's not what I'm designing for. I know, but you can machine learn anything, right? In theory. Okay, so what are the odds of a relationship working out between me and Brian, the sales guy, if I let you make all my decisions? This is getting messy, and I'm into it. Look, it's a recursive calculation, incorporating myself into the new system, but based on the data I can gather... What? 100%? Wait, wait, there is a catch, though. You have to do everything I tell you. Okay, so I can't have him. I just have to give it my autonomy. Basically. <gasps> oh, hi, Brian. Sorry, I just, um, how do I connect this to the new printer? Um, go to system preferences? Remember, he wants to feel needed. Where is that? Here, you mind? Whoa, Brad, is that you? I found it on Flickr, just say yes. Yes, that's me. Last summer, it was epic. Nice, who'd you go with? Family, definitely a family member. A family member, um, I'm my mom. Sweet, I don't think my mom could make it to the trailhead. <laughs> that was a joke. <laughs> there, you go, you're all set. Now walk away and show him that bubble butt. Hey, I, I was gonna go on a hike this weekend in Marin, but my friend bailed. Would you? Not too eager, plans on Saturday. Um, I have plans Saturday, sorry. Oh yeah, me too, I meant Sunday. Oh. Okay, yeah, I could do Sunday. Cool. Let me get your number. Yes, girl. That is if you know how to put it into the phone. What are you doing? Just giggle and type your number. Sorry, this is probably pretty dorky, but I actually don't date coworkers. That was 100% not the plan. I'm not gonna spend eternity pretending to be some clueless basic B. Fine. Suit yourself. Some people are happy single. Oh, so that's it? I'm just doomed to die alone because you can't find one person in this city that I match with organically? I mean, there's actually one in this office. You find your one true love yet? Uh, oh. Nope. Lost cause. <sighs> the cracked phone screen. Oh. Well, just give it some time. You'll see. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Super chill, down-ass bitch, baby. I will delete you. Thanks for watching. You want to see some more funny women or watch another hoo ha ha video? You just click here and you can subscribe here. It's right here. It's right, it's literally right there. You just, I'm pointing at it. So just do it.